I will never go from hence. Be comforted, dear madam. No, I will not. All strange and terrible events are welcome, but comforts we despise. Our size of sorrow proportioned to our cause must be as great as that which makes it. How oh, now? Is he dead? His death is upon him, but not dead. His guard have brought him hither. Oh, son! Burn the great sphere thou movest in. Darkling stand the varying shore of the world. Oh! Anthony! 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 Peace. Anthony! Anthony! I'm dying, Egypt. Dying. Only I hear importune death a while till of many thousand kisses the poor last I lay upon my lips. I dare not. Dear, dear, my lord, pardon. I dare not, lest I be taken. But come, come, Antony. Help me, my women. We must draw thee up. Assist, good friends. Oh, quick, or I am gone. <laughs> he has sport indeed. How heavy weighs my lord. <laughs> Our strength is all gone into heaven as that makes the weight. <laughs> Yet come a little. <laughs> Wishes were ever fools. Oh, come, come, come. And welcome. Welcome. Quicken with kissing, had my lips that power, thus would I wear them out. Give me some wine. Uh, let me speak a little. No, let me speak. Let One me... word, sweet queen. Of Caesar. Seek your honor with your safety. They do not go together. Give them, ye queen. None about Caesar trust, but Proculeus. My resolution and my hands I'll trust none about Caesar. A miserable change, now at my end. Lament nor sorrow at, but please your thoughts. And feeding them with those my former glories, wherein I lived. Greatest prince of the world, the noblest. And do now not basely die, not cowardly. Put off my helmet to a countryman, <coughs> a Roman. Buy a Roman. Valiantly vanquished. Now, my spirit is going. I can. of men would die. Hast thou no care of me? Shall I abide in this dull world which in thy absence is no better than a sty? Oh, see, my women, the crown of the earth doth melt. My lord,
withered is the garland of the war. The soldier's pole is fallen. Young boys and girls are level now with men. The odds is gone. And there is nothing left remarkable beneath the visiting moon. Oh, God, this lady. She's dead, too. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, lady. Madam. Madam, madam, madam. Royal Egypt, Empress. Peace. Peace. Ira. No more. But Ian, a woman, and commanded by such poor passion as the maid that milks and does the meanest chairs, it were for me to throw my scepter at the injurious gods, to tell them that this world did equal theirs till they had stolen our jewel. All's but not. Patience is sottish, and impatience does become a dog that's mad. Then is it sin to rush into the secret house of death, ere death dare come to us? Oh, dear women, what, what could she have? Why, and how charming, my noble girls. Oh, women, women. Look, our lamp is spent. Good sirs, take heart. We'll bury him. And then what's brave, what's noble? Let's do it after the high Roman fashion and make death proud to take us. Come away. This case of that huge spirit. Now is cold. Oh, women, women. Come. We have no friend but resolution and the briefest end.